you know, you've already said no, uh, a lot about the program. But just briefly, can you tell us uh, what is this Google Career Certificate Scholarship Program? Yeah, sure. I'm, Google is proud to announce that we're giving away 39,000 Career Certificate Scholarships. Basically, these are uh, learning programs geared towards equipping Filipinos to acquire jobs in IT-related fields. So through these online learning courses, they can learn more about UX design, project management, data analytics, and um, uh, sorry, IT support as well. Um, and this is really our commitment towards ensuring that our workforce is competitive and that they can actually land jobs in the growing IT field. What, what are you seeing in the current situation uh, around why the need to have these types of scholarships? Yeah, great question. Because like, um, despite the pandemic happening and despite economic challenges, we're seeing that there is actually a growth in demand for IT-related jobs. Um, we've seen data showing that there were thousands of available jobs across the fields I've mentioned. So we wanted to understand, like, is there a little more um, upskilling that our workforce needs to be able to get into these jobs and hopefully do well uh, in them as well? So I'm just curious, why 39,000? Is there a specific reason behind 39,000 or or, 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 or. No, sure. Like th we considered a lot of factors too. Like, um, and we landed at the number of thirty-nine thousand when we took up the environment, the macroeconomic condition as well. Um, so this is our first salvo, and we're excited to launch the thirty-nine thousand for now. So do you? Is there also a monitoring process? Because I'm, I'm thinking, baka hindi naman lahat matapos yung yeah. sayang naman. Yeah. Baga, what if, 20,000 lang. I mean, is there a monitoring? No, absolutely. So, actually, when people sign up, um, within the first six months, they have to sign up for a course. And through Coursera, we can determine whether they are actually making progress on these courses as well. Um, so, if, for example, within the first six months, they've made progress, um, they're, they can use it for up to the 12 months so that they can finish the courses. But over time, I think we can redistribute um, if we see that there's no activity in the account. So, you know, we wanted to make sure that we really use the 39,000 uh, that's being given away. So it's 39,000, is this for a year or a time frame? Is it? So we want to distribute everything by the end of this year. Um, so after people sign up um, and provided that they are actually going through the courses, they'll have 12 months to actually finish it. What is uh, the role of Globe? So Globe is, has been a fantastic partner because like um, we're aligned in terms of our vision of helping drive the digital economy. Now the, the great thing about Globe is you know, um, through their, you know, understanding so of their... Mag mag identify correct, Not correct, Google. correct. Yes, it's Globe that's helping us. Uh, together with the ICT and DTI, okay. who will nominate the scholar. So I'm just curious, for example, like, you know, you don't need a scholar, you don't want to be a scholar, can you apply for a... Can you enroll in a, Globe, uh, in a Google Career Certificate? Is it possible to... Sorry. To, sorry, can sorry, you can clarify? You repeat that? If you don't want to be a scholar, for example, can you uh, can uh, If you don't want to be a scholar. If you don't want to be yeah, a scholar. Yeah, it's readily available. Can you uh, pay? Yeah, yeah, yes, 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 it's yes, available. Yes, it's open yes, naman. Yes, if you don't yes, want to be yes. a scholar. How much will usually you get? Up? Sorry, I'm not clear oh, on that. We can get back to you. We can get back to you. But I want to determine how much you value them. We can get back to you on that. But yeah, if you don't want to take one of the 39,000, then it's actually currently available. Of course, better you. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Yes. Is it open then, Gabby, for um, non-students? Oh, absolutely. Like, um, actually, if you're 18 and above, um, you're automatically qualified naman, um, among our partners. So it doesn't need to be a student. Even pe people who are you know, not studying currently, um, people who are currently jobless or seeking to pivot to different categories or careers, for example, you're in the food and beverage industry and you want to shift into IT, I think this would be a good starter in terms of getting to that path. So 18 and above, it's open as long as you know you want to put the work in for it. How will you choose the scholars? Yeah, so it's actually through our partners who will identify the scholars. So through Globe, the ICT, and DTI, they will determine who, you know, who are more likely to finish uh, the courses that are offered. Okay. Oh, one last question. Yeah, sure. Uh, there are four courses right now. Do you, yes. ex do you plan to expand it in the future? Um, I, I can't speak about our plans for the future, but like I, I think this is a great learning opportunity for us to see how the four courses are being taken up. And like we're always opportunistic. We're looking for other avenues uh, in the future. So we'll keep an eye out and I'll share more when we have right. more news. And so just additional, yeah. lang, tama ba to say na kasi medyo mababa pa tayo in terms of IT courses in schools? In, I, I think it was mentioned in STEM. Still, hindi pa ka, ka, 
kamagaganda. This is also one way to further improve pa the, ano ba, the IT background of Filipinos. I, I think that, yeah, I think the principle in a way is really, you know, you have to exhaust all avenues where in you can learn new things. Um, so this is just one of the things that we want to add on as an option for people who really want to get into IT. So hopefully we're adding to a full a menu of what's available to the Filipino workforce. Sorry, pahabu lang. Yeah, sure. Um, are you looking forward to have a partnership then with DepEd or CHED since you're, you know, you're handling the students? Yeah, well, I mean, we have great relationships with DepEd and CHED as well. So we're always open to expanding our partnership opportunities. So I guess we, this is what we're announcing today. But over time, we're open to partnering with more. Okay. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you so much. Thank you.